Greetings and salutations, you guys. It's Hayden here. Welcome to a new video. How's everyone doing today? Hope you guys are all doing fantastic. I'm here today at the Goodwill. This is the one in, uh, I forget what city this is, but it's on Rose Drive on Placentia or State College in Rose or something. I think we're in the city of your Belinda? I think this is your Belinda. Okay, your Belinda. Anyway, this is a smaller store, but last time I was here, I found some really great stuff. So I'm really excited to see what they have today. But if you guys love thrifting, thrift hauls, vlogs, home decor videos, I'm trying to like hide from the sun. You guys love those sorts of videos. Don't forget to subscribe to the little bell button to so notify when new videos do go up. Add me on Instagram. It's Adrian, just like it's spelled here. And check out the shop. It's Adrian.com to see what I have for sale for my thrifting adventures. But without further ado, let's head in the store and go see what we can find. All right, let's go. Here we are at the Goodwill. Let's go inside and check it out. Here. Na 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 surprise. Never heard of that one yet. Waterless oil aroma diffuser. These wireless charging pads are always a good stocking stuffer. They always have a ton of those. I love that they have these like little science speaker looking things but these are from target this was originally three bucks those are cool we got some watch bands little planters oh this is actually legit cute charges wireless compatible phones airpods and airpod pros this is cool how much is this 20 bucks now this is a good stocking stuffer. Try them all in one. Vitamins. Time out. Oh wait, these are snickerdoodle. Oh, what if these are good? Am I gonna buy my diet snacks here from the Goodwill? Maybe, 15 grams of protein. That has nine fiber. Not bad. This is also my favorite, the Indian healing clay. Only six bucks. Do I buy it though? I don't really need any more at the moment, but I always need more eventually. Keto snack bar, chocolate hazelnut. Vitamins. Ooh, youthful skin. Yeah, let's look at the bags first. Let's see what we can find here today. Izod. This looks like a Dooney, but... Wait, Coach? Wait, not, wait, what? No, it's not. It doesn't feel like it now that I'm holding it. You can usually tell just by feeling it. What is this? An imposter. Oh yeah, it's not. This is... What is it? Um, green fields. We're bamboozled. Briefly. Anything else? This looks like a long chomp, but it's not. And their logo strangely looks a little bit like Telfar's logo. Nine West. Uh, cross something. Oh, this is those Target puffer bags. They look like the Lulu bags from YSL. This one looks a little Kate Spade-ish, but it's not. And looks like we reached the end of the line. Packs. Nope. Oh, this is soft. You guys, I found a coach after all. It's made in Costa Rica, so it's vintage. Oh, there's a cell phone case inside. We'll put that back in a second. Yes! How exciting. It's 20 bucks, though. But I'll probably get it. It's in pretty good condition. Oh, this is like a little thing you hang on the wall. Uh, Little box. Oh, look at this. It's tiny and cute. 
the earrings in there or something. I was looking through the knickknacks to see what they have. All the dolls are on the floor. Oh, I have this already. 15 bucks. Oh, do we have any Yetis? Let's see. Nope. These are those Zach ones that look like Yetis, but that's from Target. Um, there's a Minnie Mouse one right there. This is kind of cool looking. Hello. Those are from Target. Okay, so I don't know if anyone else is having crazy allergies right now, but my left eye has been like bugging me so intensely since yesterday. I know it's because of the allergy season. It's like all the allergens are just like flying into the air because of the temperature exchanges happening right now, but it is crazy. My eye has been like exploding, but we'll manage. It's not as bad as yesterday, but oh, that's pretty with the flowers. Who makes this? Stoneware made in Portugal. Oh, look at this plate. Pretty. I don't know why I love floral plates so much. Who do you think this is Pampered Chef? This little thing right here probably is. It looks like Pampered Chef. Oh, it is $4.99. These are such fantastic gifts, especially during the holiday, but I have a bunch already. I'll probably wait. Maybe I'm not gonna get it. I'll wait off. Ooh, the All right, we are back in business. My um, Aziza home. Oh, my battery died for a second, but we're up and running again. It's kind of cool. I like the little feet on that guy. Look at the gadgets. I'm looking for a Keurig for a gift. Is that a Roomba? We literally have that foot massaging machine. My mom loves it. Oh, there's some more of these wireless charging stations. These are actually cheaper than the ones up front. The ones up front were 20, I think. Did I make that up? These are only 17. Oh, see, yeah, 17. That one's 19. There's another one right there for 17. They're all priced a little different. They have these candle things, these are from Bath and Body, I think. $2.99, originally five bucks. That one's cute though with the Monstera. They also have this one. And they have these mirrored ones, but they're kind of messed up looking. Frightening. Unique. <laughs> Ooh, mugs. Wait a minute. This is from my Mikasa set that I got. I need to get this. This totally goes with it. That's so funny that I found this here because I bought one, like a few, like a set of plates with like little teacups and all that stuff like a few weeks ago. And this is exactly it, Mikasa corn flour. All right, do they have anything else? Let's see. Teacher, this is kind of cute. Can we see any other cool play? Oh, Latino characters. Those cups are pretty. Just found this Tiffany & Co. perfume at the register too. Hey guys, okay, so we are back at the house. I'm super excited to share with you guys what we ended up getting today. I'm so happy I went to the store because last time I went here, uh, I found some really great stuff and I found great stuff again today and I'm really excited to share with you guys what we ended up finding. So first things first is I actually found a little, I think this is like a four creamer. Um, it goes with a set that I purchased like a week or two ago at a Goodwill boutique in Tustin and I, I pretty much got like the whole dinner set. I got um, dinner plates and salad plates. And I got five cups and saucers. I wish they were eight, but I was missing three. But that's okay because it's almost a complete set. I also got a gravy boat with a gravy dish. And now I got this guy to go with the little teacups um, for the creamer. So I'm really excited. It was $2.99. So very excited to add this to that little collection going on. Um, I was hoping to find more pieces for, for that collection that matched. And I found something sooner than I thought I would. So, very excited about this guy. So, there you go. That's the first item. 
then I also ended up finding a bag just when I went through the bag and I thought I didn't find anything someone actually just discarded this by where the records were on the other side of the store and this is actually a vintage coach bag it's made in Costa Rica it's in I think this is black is it black or navy I believe this is a dark navy so this is in a navy blue color we have a front pocket right there and then the interior looks like this and then it just says, um, like inside it says, Made in Costa Rica. Um, this actually has this cute little, is this attachable? Hold on, is this attachable? <gasps> Stop! It has a little detachable key thing. I've never seen this before. How cool. It also says like coach on it too. And it like buttons. It has like a little button. It has a little button on the inside right there. And then it just snaps in. Oh my gosh, that was so hard to put back in. <laughs> but I got it back on. Jeez Louise. Uh, but this was $19.99. There's just one interior zipper pocket. The interior is suede. The leather is amazing. Just like those vintage coach bags are. It even still has the little dongle on it as well. So I'm pretty excited about it. Just needs a little bit of cleaning and conditioning. And then it's going to be to go to a new home so i'm very excited about this i love vintage coach so much you guys know how much i love finding it for you guys i know there's a bunch of you guys out there that are collectors and this is actually a really popular vintage style that um is even popular like to this day like amongst people that like collect coach or even just like bag lovers in general so i'm really excited about finding this guy for 20 dollars at the goodwill uh then as i was paying i noticed that on a card that they had behind the register um i just saw this like it looked like a crystal thing and i was like ooh shiny and lo and behold i found this tiffany and co perfume it's literally like full still pretty much um it was only six dollars and 99 cents it was in the nick it's gonna be like in the knickknack section and it actually smells really nice i actually think my mom would really enjoy this so this actually might be a piece that i'm going to be giving to mom for the holidays so this is probably going to go into her gift box that uh her thrifty gift box i'm doing for everyone um but it's really really cool it just says Tiffany and Co. right there along the top, um, underneath the, the little lid, and it look, looks like a crystal, and it's in the Tiffany blue, it's in, um, and it has like little tees on it, and it's really, really pretty, so I was super excited about this, and yeah, Tiffany and Co. perfume, I have no clue actually how much Tiffany and Co. perfume I don't know why I keep saying Tiffany & Co, but I don't know how much their perfume is. So let's actually have a quick gander. Tiffany & Co perfume. And let's see how much that stuff retails for. Um, okay, let us see. This one looks like it's the 80 or the one ounce bottle. And it looks like this guy retails for, is this the eight one ounce bottle or the, well, this is the 1.7 fluid ounces. Okay, it's actually 1.7 fluid ounces, not the one ounce. So the one ounce perfume is um, $80. And then the 2.5 ounce is 138. So this is, oh, 1.7 is $108. Oh, so crazy. There you go. $108 for this perfume at Nordstrom.com. It looks like at FragranceX.com it's on, on sale for $89.24. But yeah, $6.99. I don't think that is bad at all. And it's pretty much full still. So really excited about the find. And that is actually going to end today's video. Hope you guys had fun checking out the store with me today. If you guys ever go to that store, let me know. Tell them also Hadrian sent you. Um, and if you guys enjoyed the video, please give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to say hi down below in the comments. Especially if you guys are new to the channel. Welcome. So happy to have you guys here. Welcome to the Thrift Squad. Tune in today at 2 p.m. for the vlog. I am doing two videos every single day. A thrifting video and a vlog. The vlog may contain more thrifting. And I'm doing that every day until the end of December. Um, and also check out um, my 
Black Friday sales. I'm having a live Black Friday sales um, Tuesday night. I don't know if when you guys are going to see this, but Tuesday night of Thanksgiving week, then Saturday night of Thanksgiving week end at 10 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. So it's Tuesday and Saturday. And then um, another one on Monday. And that time for that is TBD, but probably around 10 p.m. too, if not earlier. But that is going to end today's video. Thank you guys again so much for hanging out today. I love you guys immensely. See you guys all in the next video. All right, bye guys.